It's been said that each human being's growth moves in an arc from dependence to independence to interdependence. As kids, we're dependent on parents and other authorities for our very survival. As young adults, we begin the journey toward independence, self-determination, authenticity. And if we're lucky as we age, we get to express our independent spirit in our careers and our art and just in the daily act of living. And as we get older, if we achieve a modicum of wisdom, we realize our interdependence, our connection to and responsibility for all other beings, the earth itself. It's a basic human urge to travel this arc from dependence to independence to interdependence. Some people rush through a stage or get stuck in a stage, often by no choice of their own. Boys are often rushed through the dependent stage, told to be a man long before they're ready to be anything but a little boy. Girls are often kept in the stage of dependence, told that for their own good, they must forgo being an independent person in the world. This wounds boys being rushed out of dependence, and it wounds girls being stuck independence. Whole groups of people suffer from being obstructed or rushed on the ark. The women's movement is the story of one group rising up to confront the barriers to independence. In the light of history, the women's movement is still a new struggle. And for many women in different parts of the world, the movement has barely begun. And the burgeoning men's movement represented by many of the men speaking this weekend. It's even a newer movement. I want us to remember our sisters and our brothers who, like us, long to travel the ark in a natural and exciting and, and easy way, but they can't because where they live, they're not allowed to. And everyone in this room is at a different stage due to our age or our culture or our upbringing. But traveling the arc from dependence to independence to interdependence, it's not a race. And it's not a straight line. It's a messy process, and we're all in it together. So I'm going to end with a quote from a speech that Gloria Steinem gave at a Women in Power conference about 10 years ago. Gloria said this, we can't get to interdependence until we have experienced healthy independence. We can't skip a stage. But nonetheless, interdependence truly is the stage for which women and men are all hoping. Men can get stuck in independence. Women often get stuck in dependence. But we're all waiting to get to the place where we can be interdependent with another human being without losing ourselves. We are all waiting to give birth to ourselves. Thank you.